In this video, I'm going to show you how to make this really cool and simple origami dinosaur. So to begin, we're going to make a bird base. And you want to start by taking your square piece of paper and folding it in half diagonally. Opening it back up again and folding it in half the other diagonal. And then open it up again. Now flip it over and fold it in half, first horizontally, and then vertically. And then open it back up again. Now you want to position it so that one of the points is facing towards you. Now what you want to do is you want to bring the right hand side and the left hand side both down to meet that bottom point like that and this will naturally now bring in the top down and you can just push it down to flatten it and it should look like this. Now what you want to do is you want to take each of the sides, each of these and fold them into the center. So there should be two layers take both of them on the top layer and fold them into the center and then you can flip it over and fold them both on the bottom layer <coughs> excuse me into the center like that now what you can do is you can open those two flaps and take the very top layer of the paper and bring it all the way up to the top and that should naturally open this up and then you can simply push the edges back in on the lines you made before pushing them into the center on previous folds and then you can close it back down again. Then take the top point and bring it back up to the top and flatten it on the top. So it should look like this. Then do the same on the other side. So open the two flaps, take up the top layer and pull it up. Then bring the sides in, pushing them in. like this, flattening them down, then bringing that layer back up to the top. So what you want to do, you want to orientate the bird base, which is now finished, so that the open end is facing the right. And what you want to do, you want to take the top layer, the top triangle on the left, and fold it over to the right so it should look like this. Now what you want to do is you want to fold the top half, if you imagine, all the way down the center line. Fold the top half down to meet the bottom like that. So now the model should look like this. Now what you want to do, on the left hand side there'll be two layers this large layer here and the small triangle here. What you want to do is you want to make an outside reverse fold pulling the top layer back so it's vertical like that and then flattening it. So just to outline that step from that To that. And that's the dinosaur's neck. So now to make the head, you want to make another outside reverse fold, putting your thumb 
inside the neck and pushing about the last inch back outside of the neck over the top so it should look like this from that to this now just to make the nose look a bit more realistic you just want to push the last few millimeters back inside and that just squares off the nose now what you want to do with the rear of the dinosaur you'll see there's three layers like that the two outside layers become the legs so what you want to do you want to take the top layer and you want to fold it down so that it meets the neck vertically there and do the same on the other side folding it down vertically so it's exactly like the other leg now what you want to do is you want to focus on the small arms of the dinosaur so you take this little triangle here and you want to push it down keep pushing until you have a small triangular tab that's sticking down like that and then you finish the small arms of the dinosaur and now to make the feet on each leg you want to take the last inch and fold it inside like that so turn the model over take a leg take the last inch and fold it back inside the model like this and now just make sure the feet are both equal like that Once you've done that, you can just adjust the angle of the feet to make sure that the model will stand up by itself. And you've completed the origami dinosaur.